the year was 1896. Again, in search of knowledge, the net was cast into the sea of the unknown, and like in our fable, a catch was made, an accidental catch. The discovery was made by Henri Becquerel, a French scientist. Today I discovered something very strange. I happened to leave a piece of uranium on a wrapped photographic plate in a dark drawer. When I developed the plate, I found that it was fogged. Apparently, the uranium had exposed it, even in the darkness and through the wrapping. This uranium, it seems to possess some mysterious activity and give off some type of radiation all by itself. C'est extraordinaire. Becquerel had discovered radioactivity. Pierre and Marie Curie, two other French scientists, were greatly intrigued by this strange phenomenon. While seeking the source of the radiations from uranium, they discovered a new element, which gave off even stronger rays. Look, our new element. How radiant it is. It even glows in the dark. We should call it radium. Radium turned out to be a mysterious source of energy. This remarkable element would go on radiating like an endlessly flowing spring. This was against all laws of science known at that time. How could this tiny mass contain so much energy? This mystery shook the very foundations of science.